guys, hope you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more of our EU4 Dutch World Conquest campaign here, and uh, things are going well. We are currently sieging down España, and uh, we just need to make our make our rounds over here. Our manpower is quite bad, but it is getting better. We are working on these guys. Uh, for some reason, there is like a... I don't even want to know where those ships were coming from. Are you guys pulling ships from somewhere across the country, across the world? I don't know. I don't want to know. But we're going to start consolidating some land over here in uh, Africa. Um, those guys are going down there. Certainly don't need that many cannons. Let's just have you guys join up over here and have you guys join up over here. See if we can stack wipe these guys on Lisboa. We certainly have the men. 30 to 45. They have 35. So they actually will outflank us. We're going to lose some cannons there. But I think it'll be okay. Stack wipe? No stack wipe, unfortunate. But thinking we can catch them, no problem. These guys keep hurting my colonies. Dang it. I don't know where they're going. Oh, what? Where are you going? Actually. Yeah, they're going to reinforce, so I'm not actually going to worry about them. Let's see here. If I can catch them out, like, over here in Cordoba or Sevilla. Because this one, I can definitely stack with them. Even in the... Ooh. Goodbye. There we go. That's all she wrote. Alright, cool. So, let's get a war declared over here. You'll have Kano, which is right here. So I'll actually be able to full annex both of them. Kanem Bornu. Um, okay. Well, I think I can... He's only like... He's low dev, so I'll probably be able to uh, full annex him without co-belligerenting him. So, this is fine. Let's go ahead and send... Um, send you over there. We do have some cannons, too, so we'll be able to siege them down in a timely manner. This piece is actually coming very quickly. Okay, let's have you guys just like split up and get out of the way so you're not... Why are you black flagged? That doesn't seem right. Okay. We are done. Capped on Diplo, so I'll do that. I'll actually be able to upgrade our heavies, so I'll do that for sure. Milan has entered the coalition. And a bunch of other people left, so... What's that say? Okay, very good. And I'll keep the truce a little bit on the shorter side. This is fine with me. We have very close to the right amount of admin. Um, just in order to keep it clean, I will wait a couple months. Abolition of Slavery Act. Decreased tech cost. Oh, that's kind of nice. So I don't really care if I fall behind on admin tech at this point, because I have basically everything I'm ever going to need. Most of my points now should be going toward um, uh, coring costs, so that's fine. Speaking of that, I also need to make sure I have these guys over here. For some reason, some of them look like they died off. <laughs> uh, okay, let's get you guys down here. We go since my guys cannot handle their own let's go ahead and do that it's fine with me get some more trade goods i don't need to be focusing war anymore so let's go ahead and focus on stability make sure we're not getting any rebels what else does this give us diplo rep very nice and uh we'll just wait like two months livestock bunch of tropical wood bunch of good stuff right all good stuff I think that's fine. Force limit is almost one million. Let's actually see where we're at on these points here. So we can demand Diplo, but I certainly don't need Diplo. Let's actually see right here. Hmm. Is he half off? certainly take a half off guy oh he's in the wrong culture group so absolutely not 
If you're not the right culture, which is Danish, or Dutch, I mean, oh, I said Danish. I didn't mean it, guys. I'm sorry. I take it back. Please don't hurt me. Um, <laughs> there we go. One more month and we're going to force peace and force our peace. Okay, very good. Winning sieges left and right. They're not going to be able to do anything down here because we have forts. Oh, that's not true. This fort in Benin actually doesn't do anything. Well, in that case, let's build some forts down here, eh? Let's build one like there. Build one like here. Upgrade that one. These two will communicate, and this one will block off everything from here, so these are good. This one will need one over like here, so these will communicate, and those will communicate. So those are good. Oh yeah. Trying to invade, trying to fight me is like Fort Hell. Alright, so next month, we now have the correct amount of admin. Wait, at some reason it went down? That doesn't sound, that does not seem right. I'm thinking... Excuse me? It, it definitely went down, am I wrong? I was at 90 overextension. An island I was trying to grab might have been... I think this one got taken from them, maybe? I feel like this was Spanish. Okay, that's Scottish Indonesia. That's pretty cool. Alright, well, if that's the case, and that's nice, I can take a little bit more land over here. Or maybe I could even have them concede. Or do I care? The heck? I get some of the most whack things. Um... No, I won't do it. I will just keep the truce nice and short. I don't need them to concede Mexico. Short truce is fine. I will... Well, not short truce as far as like... I will just take a little bit of extra. Let's actually take the forts here. It's good with me. It's really good overextension. We can handle it, so let's take it. Let's core everything up. I actually didn't look to see if I could core everything, so hopefully we can. Very close, unfortunate. Oh, this is all zero overextension anyway, so we're good. None of this matters. Good stuff. Okay, so let's get you guys split. Carpus siege him down over here. Let's think about our next war. I think Yemen is certainly on the docket. I know that I was recruiting a bunch of heavies over here. So let's get you guys over here. We can actually grab our transports. Um manpower is actually starting to stick up, or to tick up, I should say. Let's get a little bit more mercs over here. Could attack Luba. We don't have any men over there right now, though. We have this 20 stack just chilling here. Uh, so let's get you guys over here. Get that 20 stack up here as well to join in on the fun. Let my people go. Unknown, unknown will now be produced. Our trader is dead. Unfortunate. He was the correct culture and everything. Well, I would like either to that or a Diplo advisor. So let's see here. Let's actually just get rid of all of them. Okay. There we go. None of them are the correct culture. Okay, so they love me now. We can now send you guys up there, send you guys, let's come, we have so many just random armies just all over the place. So I'm thinking, let's grab the infantry from here, have these cannons march up here. 
uh, have these cannons get uh, transferred over from there to up here. Let's have you guys all join up over here. Need to remember to split them though. Deplore up is fine. I need to feed Prussia. So let's give him Pomerania. Austria would help. Will be considered a co-belligerent. Oh, well that actually might be my chance to annex him. Let's make sure I could if I really wanted to. I cannot, unfortunately. Well, I still need to look that up. I haven't done it yet. I think it's okay. I'm pretty sure that if I full annex Austria, I will get him. Either that or he'll just get independence, which would be really lame. But it might be the case. I can't imagine he's going to be a vassal for much longer anyways. Let's get him full occupied. Let's get these guys over... They're in all infantry, so it's not worth it. Let's just get them like over here and we'll have them run up here. Bunch of natives and colonies that I've taken from other people. Okay, let's get you guys there. 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 Oh, right, yep. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Actually don't need these guys here, for sure. So let's actually have you guys come down here and start sieging back this land just to make sure that they're not getting any war score that they don't deserve. They have to fight for it, you know? So as far as our next war goes, what do we want? Dutch Eastern Europe is looking good. Truce with the Ottomans is going to be up here in two years. Croatia is in the coalition, I believe. Yeah, so is Milan. Dang. So this is a much better looking stack. Still needs more cannons. Let's go ahead and have you guys group up here. Let's have these guys... Wait. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to be building any more men. Not with manpower. So let's do this here. So... We are going to flip almost exclusively to mercs. Uh, we are going to flip exclusively to mercs. Um, so our cat infantry 38. So we need we have 46 cannons in that one. So uh, what am I doing here? Here we go. So I do want this just mercs. And that's just for a little like quick raise army, and then this one will be army. And so it will be 38 and 38. So this one will be, no, not here. This one will be here. Get those cannons elsewhere. Now, do I have any unrest over here? Am I looking at the right map mode? Right here? None. Oh, it's so good. These guys are definitely gonna need Cannons. Reap the administrative benefits? Sounds good to me. Beautiful. Tech cost is nice. Corruption is unfortunately going up, so it might be in my best interest to start stating stuff up. It's because I'm overextended, but I intend on completely just being overextended for the rest of the game, more than likely. Next war is going to be... Eating the Ottomans, we need to get to war with Manchu very soon as well. I have borders with him, or not quite, but these guys are all in the coalition. So, this is grassland, so force limit's pretty good up here. Let me see here. Let's get you guys over there. Let's get you guys also joined up over there. So let's get you guys over, uh, what are these? Those are galleys, interesting. Let's get you guys over there, and let's go ahead and pull those galleys over there as well. Very good. It's getting to the point now where I kind of want to start, you know, <laughs> getting my land connected. The naval game is fun, but it's uh, a bit strenuous, to say the least. Okay. I would like to, uh, you know get to war with France here, but it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to. Who are you allied to? Scotland and Provence. Is Provence in the coalition? They are. And so is Scotland. Huh. Yeah, so that's not going to work. 
Might as well get them top, topped off. We're not going to be able to... Uh, we're going to need to probably annex them. So I can free up slots for more... Um, more dudes. Truce with them is up when? September 16. So we got plenty of time. Make sure we got everything over here looking good. Very good. Alright. People are leaving the coalition. I would really like, like, Sweden to leave the coalition. Or Sweden, uh, Scotland. Okay, so Kano is... What? Oh, he's got land down there as well. Interesting. Well. Plan on full annexing him completely. What is this? What the heck? Where's that at? D-A-L-L-O-L. I bet it's one of these guys over here. Interesting. No. That's okay if he's an OPM. As soon as I take his capital, he'll surely let me have it. Alright. So, you guys are going to give me that. Overextension is bad now. Because I didn't check, so... That's okay. We'll manage it. Our, our unrest is not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. What is this? Poi... Poiyang? Rebel sentiment, I bet. Yeah. So it's fine. We should be good. Um... Manchu's got no allies I care about. Yeah, definitely. So I would actually be able to just have these guys hang out down here. Hmm. Alright. Yeah, because I'm going to have to go to war with the Ottomans. As soon as our truce is up, like, I have to attack them. I do not have a choice. Okay. Apologize for the Discord noises. Hmm. Let's get those guys off of their lands. I don't want them sieging any of their stuff back. There we go. Building that fort. Very good. Making progress. Dutch Africa starting to look nice. Now everything's all connected up here. Gonna need to take this stuff in Luba. And this stuff should be connected. Though I don't know. With that stuff not touching down there, that might not uh, actually look nice like that. Buha. There you go. Okay. A couple of months, we'll be able to get our cannons upgraded. So we're gonna definitely need to... Uh, do this. Get you guys out of there. Let's actually have you go ahead and disband them. And then let's go ahead and split them there. Let's put these guys there. There we go. Armies are starting to look a little bit nicer. Okay. We have a lot of transports there as well. I reckon the Ottomans still have a superior navy to us. How's their money looking? Oh yeah, they're gonna go bankrupt here soon, so this is good. If I'm gonna go revolutionary, I really need to do it, like, very soon. So if we're gonna do it, we just need... We just need low stab. There's a couple ways that you can get it to tick up. Let me get a idea here. So, revolution, disaster, U4. Pretty sure it's uh, taking out a bunch of loans. I think that's one of the keys um, to get it taken up a little bit faster. So our absolutism is maxed out, so that will give us at least one one and a half per month. Bankruptcy would give us two, but we're not going to do that. War exhaustion of at least five. If I wanted to truce break, but I don't want to spend the admin on that, so we're not going to do that. Um, prestige less than zero. I can do that easily enough. And 25 loans. Well, 
I might as well, right? Spend all the money on uh, stuff to pay it off anyway, so it's fine. There we go. We need what? Stability less than zero. So do we just do this then and give us zero? I don't think it'll actually go below zero, so that would not work actually. Um, I suppose I could just break a royal marriage, right? And then declare that war? Or just... Yeah. Yeah, this would be good, because... Um, so I should probably declare war on one of his guys. Yeah, like, break a truce on him. On him. That will give me the, um, truce break. But Austria will be a co-belligerent, so I'll be able to take his land. I'll do imperialism, which would allow me to take a bunch of his land, which would be really good. So this is good. Um... We have a lot of money, but I don't know if I actually want to spend all that much of it. Hmm. Okay, regardless, so we have our 25 loans. We need to get our prestige low, and we need to get negative stability. So, let's go ahead and royal marry somebody. Prussia, Paris, and Kaffa. You want to royal marry me, Kaffa? Oh wait, I have Diplo ideas, do I not? Dang. So how do I lower my stab, man? I could just no CB somebody. No CB one person, and then yes, yeah, so just go ahead and like no CB these guys. That'll lose one stab, one more exhaustion. Wait one month. And then we will um, declare on Brunswick. Austria will join. It will cause. Oh, didn't mean time to be passing there. We're gonna go for Hant Imperialism. There we go. Now we should start ticking up for our disaster here. It should be at a decent pace as well. Three and a half. So it'll start here in May of 17. One of the following must be true. Currently in a disaster. So I can boost my... This is actually going up. War exhaustion. Absolutism. Number of loans. And I can lower my prestige enough to get it up a little bit more as well. Plus I can get all these guys nice and loyal. So that'll be good. Placate, placate, placate. Portuguese Peru. So who who is the one with the largest army that's disloyal? There we go. Dutch Mexico. Placate and placate. There we go. It's going to go up pretty quick, but then I'll just placate again. What? Rebels? And Ning Chao? NG Chao. No, NG Chao. There you go. Okay, so let's get those guys down there. That's fine. You guys can go kill those rebels there. Prestige is good. So we're going up. It'll be here in November of next year. So Fala. Oh, come on now. Oh, it's a lot of rebels. Okay, so let's get you guys over there. And go ahead and get some mercs down there. This is probably going to be a huge hassle. But, uh... So let me just make sure... Stab at least three. So if I go up to one stab, it's not going to be an issue. And I won't have the rebels still. When can I do this? Not for a while. All right. What is my... Um, we have stability focus. 167. Jeez, why is that so expensive? Overextension. Of course. Well, that will be going away here soon enough. All right, so... Let's do that. Let's actually make sure we get a second stack of those guys. Are we building two or three? Uh, where's the button for that? Right here. I guess we're building three. That's fine. It's fine. I don't care. So we are now at war with all of these guys over here, which is good. We kind of wanted it, so let's go ahead and have you guys come over here. Have you guys come over here. Where are we at? Let's have you guys come over here to Trier. 
And have you guys siege down Alsace. We're good, and this guy can just be cannon fodder over here. Okay, looking good. Get you guys all grouped up there. Let's go ahead and call in the rebels. It's fine, should be no problem. Let's actually make sure we get a general in there, just for a, a little extra boost there. There we go. Let's go ahead and split half of them away. Have you guys put down rebels and the rest? Beautiful. So we do have some unrest. Lots of unrest, actually. From war exhaustion. Norwegian separatists, huh? Wow, that's quite a large chunk of cash to be spending. Um, is it going to be a large group? 53k? What? Really? Oh, wow. Um, I guess I'm sending some mercs over here to uh, put down rebels for you, so... Get like 40,000 rebels up there, or 40,000 mercs up there. And we're just gonna. Oh, wait. Alsace didn't join, so who are we at war with? Literally, this is all just Austria. Okay, cool. Let's get to. Let's get up here with Munster. Overextension will be gone here soon. We'll be able to get our stab up again. Yeah, we do already have this guy. This is where. Um, the icon of St. Michael would be nice. Hopefully he attacks me here. He does. Let him lock in. Let's go ahead and get Philippe's over there. Have you force march in. Where were those rebels at? Woon. Let's get you guys over there and get you guys back up over there. Let's get uh, him in charge there. I think that should be good. Dutch peasants is right here. Norwegian separatists did pop. And where are they? Okay. So it's only 45,000 now. Okay, we won that fight over here. I actually didn't see the numbers. That's fine. Oh, okay. So that's quite a lot of men. We can certainly send some men down there. Let's get you down there and get you, like, carpet sieging up top. Up here. There we go. Munster is done. gonna be done. It actually helps break up our coalition a little bit as well. Let me get OBS up here. Alright, this episode has gone on long enough. Um... So, as our coalition ticks down, we have revolution on its way, and uh, I'm going to just let them siege it down. Siege down my capital. Should be not too big of an issue. Um, I'm not entirely sure. I'm going to do a little bit of research, make sure I'm doing everything correctly, but I think we're good. And uh, we're going to, so it'll be here in a year and a half. Yes, year and a half. We're going to be able to piece out this war here in about five months here. Dutch particularists, that's not what I like to see, but that's okay. I'll just send the general over there. Oh, of course. I didn't even realize I was getting attacked. Minor inconvenience, my favorite. More rebels, like you do. These Wu separatists are... Uh, we go that should be fine so i hope you guys are enjoying and if you are please show your support and leave a like if you uh want to leave a like it honestly is the best the best way to show me that you're enjoying what i'm doing so if you do that it helps me out with the youtube algorithm and all that as well so i appreciate it a ton if you guys want to subscribe if you haven't already it is the best way to keep up to date with the channel we have literally rebels quite literally everywhere this is going to be quite a pain in my tuchus. Oh my, what in the, are you kidding me? Why? Is it literally just because I'm overextended? Yeah, man.
My overextension is going to be gone for another two months either. I'm just going to pay the admin. That is so not worth it. Holy crap. I'm actually considering... Yeah, I'm just going to buy that down. That's literally not worth it at all. Those rebels are going to crush me. So that's just going to push it back another like six months. It's no big deal. <laughs> I'm really going to have to come down and kill off all these rebels. Every single one of them. Regardless, don't forget to show your support, leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. If you want to check out the Discord and the Patreon, links are in the description down below. And with all that being said, this is Chewy Shoot, and I'll catch you guys later. Special thanks to Bloodbound92, Yadaldo, Jaron Clampett, CWG Dutch Terror, Valentel, Corbett Gaming, Palmer, Classified for Life, Airborne Animal 7, Uncle Donald, Lambda Driver, Damian Hartvig. You guys rock. I appreciate you. Don't forget to subscribe. Catch you guys later.